The Cougars. We're ready to get this one underway as the teams are lined up for the opening kick. Excellent kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. Oklahoma State's a team and a program that year in, year out, has got 1,000-yard rushers. Sometimes they've got two, and they've got that huge offensive line, and, you know, you get too worried about them, and sometimes you can overlook the fact that it's over. It's going to be tough today for this defense. I think they're going to have to take some chances and load this line of scrimmage. And, you know, as a play caller for this offense, when you have such a gifted running back, it opens up every aspect of the offense. I mean, the play action pass with this running game, you get those linebackers and safeties coming up close to the line of scrimmage. It's a great time to really open up and, and show what you can do as a complete offense. It'll be a challenge. He's taken down at the 40, about six yards on the play. Well, he really didn't have to do too much there to give himself a little room to make the catch. They'll spread the field here. Let's see what the defense does with a five wide outlook. Slings it out there. Tight end's got another one. They'll bring him down at the 35. So they'll get the first down there on the five-yard completion. And still, this gunslinger hasn't missed a receiver yet on this drive. Steps out of bounds. The 33-yard line. Passes and it's almost picked off. It's an intelligent play by the defenders. All you have to do sometimes is get your hand on the ball. Third down now. They need to get it to the 25. the 43. Man, these guys can be aggressive. When you stand back there and take hits like that, you definitely are going to feel it the next day. The punter is going to try to pin them deep in their own territory with a good punt here. It's out of bounds at the three-yard line. At the three-yard line. The quarterback brings his troops out onto the field for the first drive of the game. Four down, four down. Hey, check Mike 45, check Mike 45. Dog four. Yeah. Three yard gain by the running back. Call it a gain of three yards. That'll make it second and seven. From their own six yard line, second down. Watch the run, watch the run. Quick pass, two-yard pickup. You know, this veteran wide receiver is not always easy to stop, so that's a good job here by the defense to slow him down. No good. And that'll bring up a punting situation. Yeah, they just couldn't connect on a pass there. That was a very good stand by this defense. And they're coming after this punter. He punts it away, and it's a great kick. Brought down at the 48. And so far, it's been totally even. In close games like this, every possession is likely to matter. Looks like someone got a head start on the line. False start, offense. That penalty drives them back, and they're shooting themselves in the foot here. Well, they could just keep their concentration to avoid situations like that. So we'll have first and 15 after the penalty. It's on the ground. The offense scoops it. Around the 48-yard line. 
They completed it, but for a minimal gain. It's not much, but at least it's positive yards. Throws it deep. Oh, boy, almost intercepted. That brings us to 15. Booming kick. This punt bounces into the end zone, and this will be a touchback. This is a fun game, and I think we're going to see a lot of interesting football before it's over. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Now he tries to buy some time. Brought down right around the 28-yard line. That's good for a game of eight yards. That makes it second and two. It's second down, and they're about two yards away from the sticks. Pulls it in, and he's in the open field. He's tackled right around the 42-yard line. What a throw for a big game. That is a great example of the quarterback seeing the whole field and finding the guy who had the best chance of making a catch. Takes it right. He can't get back to the line. That'll bring up second and 11. From their own 41 yard line. Second down. Watch the screen. Hey, check Mike 45. Check Mike 45. Red 85. He's scrambling. They bring the quarterback down. Call it a loss of two yards on the play. That'll make it third and 13. So that sack will back them up a little now. And they're looking at a difficult third and 13. He rifles it. Makes the catch and look out for the 20. And he's tackled around the 16-yard line. His secondary better tighten it up. They're going to slow down this drive. And the big pickup through the air has made it first and ten. And he's tackled after positive yardage. That makes it second and six. run up the gun. And this is the eighth play of the drive. Look at the scramble down. He can't get away from the pressure. Five yards on the play. That brings up second and goal. From the 10 yard line, it's second down. Here we go, here we go. Zipped it out, and that was almost picked off. Tenth play of the drive. That makes it 30. Strike to the receiver, touchdown. And he hits the PAT. 
A 10 play 80 yard drive and they come away with a touchdown. Brad, I thought that was a textbook drive. I thought they did a really good job of showing balance, mixing the play calling with the run and the pass. Just an overall well executed touchdown. Drive. So our score, 7 0. And he got all of this one. Great kick. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The Cougars have found a way to shut this offense down, but hey, it's still early in the football game. Yeah, give them a lot of credit for the way they've played up to this point, but just based on watching these teams and preparing for this game, not be surprised to see this offense eventually find itself and start to execute much better. Throws it out and it falls incomplete. Second down and 10 to go. Ball on their own 25. Scrambling around. And down he goes around the 34-yard line. Not a lot of offense in quarter number one, but nonetheless, we've got a close game. 7-0, Cougar. Welcome back here. We resume action now here in the second quarter. Here's the handoff, and he's brought down right away. The punting team's got to give their kickers some time. He gets it away, and this is a really nice punt. Tries to get around the corner. He's tackled at the 22-yard line. Momentum swings have been fairly even, and with so little separation, this game can be drastically changed on just one or two plays. Brigham Young is up a score. Going long. It's going the other way. Tackle made around the 42-yard line. It makes it so much easier to play corner when the defense can cause bad throws by getting good pressure in the backfield. From their own 42-yard line, first down. Dangerous throw, and this one's picked off. At the 30, to the 20. Tackle at about the five-yard line. And he probably should never have thrown that ball. When your receivers are covered like that, sometimes as a quarterback, it's better to just take the sack than take your chances with a throw. It's first down, and they'll be looking for six points here. The defense was just all over that play. It didn't fool anybody. That brings up second and goal. Let's go! There he goes! And they make the stop just outside the goal line. This is where the defense makes a name for themselves. It's third down and goal from the one. Let's see if they try to pound it in here. Both teams have their goal line sets on the field. Touchdown, Cougars. And he converts the extra point. The kicker looks like he's ready to kick this one off. He just drills this one. And they can forget about returning this one. The Cowboys know, I think, that at some point, they just have to do what they do, even if it's not working right now. If they can get it going in the second half, it should really improve the ball game and the offense. Well, the offensive line, I think, also has to be accountable here. Uh, we look so much to our star players, and we always want them to put up big numbers. 
But to me, the two go hand in hand. When a running back's going to have a great game, the offensive line deserves some credit. When a running back's struggling, you got to look at that offensive line and say, fellas, you got to help me out. We're not going to change or deviate from this game plan. We need to be able to change this game around, and it starts up front with the offensive line. Here's the halfback. Makes it out to about the 49. That's a game made on the ball. That'll bring up second and three. 41's coming. 41's the mic. So don't say nothing. And he's taken down around the 50-yard line. That's a game made on the ball. And they got to him before he could get back to the line. And that won't be enough for the first down. Great job here by the defense in shutting down the run. That's a real boost for this team. They've got 10 guys up. They're coming after the kick. Oh, excellent punt. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. You know, if I'm calling the plays for this offense based on what happened last series, I just continue to go back and run the football. Force this defense to show that they have the ability to stop you from running before you adjust your own play call. He's taken down at the 20-yard line. Number 21 was the intended receiver on the play. That makes it second and 10. Second down, 10 yards to go. Ball on the 20-yard line. They come out in a five-wide set. Flushed out, and he's going to get sacked. That'll bring up third and long. Wants to throw outside. Stays in bounds to make a nice catch. From their own 33 yard line. First down. And he's tackled right away. Cougars will use their first time out of the half. Tackled after a decent pickup. From their own 44-yard line, it's first down. There's a strike complete. They'll bring him down right around midfield. Number 45 on the tackle at the 50-yard line. That'll bring up second and three. And they've got all their DBs in there to match up against the five-wide set. Now he's scrambling. And they got him. A defensive end with this kind of speed is an offense's worst nightmare. He's got the ability to collapse the pocket on any given pass play. And as a play caller, you constantly have to be aware of him. Whether you're going to roll away from him or you're going to chip with a tight end or a running back, you're constantly concerned and aware of a big, strong defensive end. Ready! And he can't get away from the pressure. Brad, not only did they give up a sack here, but their quarterback just got hit and hit hard. If I'm an offensive coordinator, especially an offensive line coach, I'm getting a hold of my offensive line, making sure these guys are on the same page, and they've got to take more pride in taking care of their quarterback than that play right there. He makes it out maybe to the 26-yard line. I think I can count on one hand the last time I saw this good a defensive performance where you had a chance for a shutout. Are you kidding me in college football today with the spread and the running quarterbacks and all the speed and space? These guys got a chance to put up a shutout. The defense has got some of their best pass defenders on the field. They set up in the dime to counter that five wide receiver set. 
Throws it in a hurry. That makes it second and eight. A quarterback in the gun with five receivers. Don't kill, kill, kill! Orange, three, orange! And he's hit immediately. That's a smart play here by the quarterback. He threw it into the window the zone coverage gave him. Nice pass and a nice job by the receiver running the slam. He guns it. And it's going the other way. We're going to find out what kind of character this football team has. I mean, I thought they had a chance to get back into this game. Now this big interception, let's find out what kind of fight and character they have to try to get back in the game. First and 10, ball on the 44-yard line. They'll spread the field with five wide. He airs it out. Nice grab on the play. Touchdown, BYU! He makes his second touchdown grab of the game. The quarterback knew exactly where to put the pass, and the receiver went out there and made the grab. Good communication there. Splits the uprights with the extra point. With only a few ticks left on the clock before halftime, I would expect he'll just quick kick this one. He really got a hold of that kick. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. An interception cut this offense last drive short, so I think they're going to be looking for a little more success right here. The first rule on offense is to take care of the football. These guys need to remember that on this drive. We've reached halftime, and I don't think too many people were expecting this. 21 to nothing, BYU. Hi, everybody. Glad to have you with us on the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 Halftime Show presented by Nissan. Innovation that excites. Bruce Davis, David Pollock here in the studio as always to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first 30 minutes. They make teams underdogs for a reason. And we saw the reason in the first half. Very decisive lead right now. And, and there appears to be very little hope of this team clawing its way out of this hole. No, I, I don't know where you're going to take the positives from. It was a really bad first half, and you're the underdog. You'd like to see more, and I'd like, you'd like to see some. All right, Reese and David, thanks, guys. Second half action, just about ready to start here. He kicks it off, and he got all of that one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. We're about set to start things up again. Empty backfield, quarterback in the gun. Five wide receivers. The tailback picks up a solid seven yards on the counter play. Second down, and they're going to need about three yards to pick up the first down. Five wide. And they'll get him in the backfield. It's a great play by the defense, but you know it really makes you wonder, was there a miscommunication up front by the offensive line? They just seemed to allow the defensive line to get through, and the running back didn't have much of a chance at all. Caught, open field, brought down at the 45-yard line. We've got a first and 10. Ball on the 45. Up, 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 up. Watch two, watch three. 
and he throws it away. Good job here by the defense. If you let this quarterback set and throw, he'll kill you all game. But they got excellent pressure on that play. Tackled right around the 44-yard line. It's first and 10. Ball on the 44. They come out in an empty backfield. Gets it to his wide receiver, and he's got another one. He's pushed out of bounds at the 32. Receiver incomplete. Number two, Number two the intended receiver, receiver on the play. play. That makes Second and ten. ten. Ball on the 32. Roger, Roger. Hey, check my 45. Check my 45. Let's go. He's going to try and scramble. And he's tackled at the 30. So the quarterback scrambles for about two yards on the play. Great play by the senior linebacker to step up in traffic and make that tackle. It's the ninth play of the drive. Rose, and that one's going to hit the ground incomplete. They'll call on the field goal unit here for this long field goal attempt. Kicks up, and he nails the long field goal. Brigham Young gets set to kick this one away. Nice kick, plenty of distance. And it goes into the end zone, down for a touchback. The Cougars continue to get it done on the defensive side of the football, Kirk. Yeah, they've done a good job of building this lead and almost determined here to protect it. Let's see if they can hold on here for the rest of the way. There's got to be some sense of urgency to this offense right now. They don't have the luxury of wasting drives if they want to get back in the game. First down grab by the receiver, and down he goes, right around the 42-yard line. Good job here by the receiver to look the ball in and ensure he had possession. That's the right way to catch a pass. Makes a catch, and he's got nowhere to go. That makes it second and eight. Quick throw, almost intercepted. Braddy drops the ball here. I don't know if he's starting to peek downfield and think about the return or what, but that ball's right in his hands. He just dropped it. Third down, and they need to get it inside the 48. They spread the field in the gun with five wide receivers. Fires to his receiver, first down. First down. 22 by 22. They'll line up with five wide receivers. Go. Going for it all to the end zone. Almost intercepted. So it's second and ten. Ball on the 47. Mike 22, he's coming. 22's coming. Mike, Mike. Here we go. Here we go. Three, nine. Three, nine. Three, three. He gets rid of this one. Complete. He's got room. He's out of bounds at about the 35. This guy is one of the most reliable receivers around. They needed a big play on third down, and he got it for him. Fires it out. Tackle made around the 25 yard line. Number nine makes the tackle at the 25 yard line. That'll make it second and inches. They'll make the 
the sack. I think that one's on the offensive line. They've got to do a better job of holding their blocks, or else this quarterback's going to be pulling turf out of his face mask all game. Third down now, and they need to get it to the 25. Quick pass, and he's immediately tackled. Nice gain, but not enough for the first down. Yeah, that's a nice play there. They did everything right except get enough yards for the first down. He gets it up, and it's long enough, and he just drilled it from long range. They're ready for the kick. Excellent kick. And it sails out of the end zone for a touchback. Oklahoma State's been throwing the punches, and they're all landing right now. You're telling me, Brad, just an incredible effort in all three phases, and they're sitting on this comfortable lead with a quarter to go. So they're just about set to get the game going again. He's on the run. Tackle at the 34-yard line. That brings up second and Short yardage situation here. It's second down and one. Four down, four down. Key at 33, key at 33. And they make the stop, the 37-yard line. Five guys will be out in the pattern as they're in the shotgun. Let's go! Brought down after a nice run up the middle. Gaining four yards. That makes it second and six. Second down and six. Ball on their own 41. Hey, check Mike 45. Check Mike 45. And a quick throw. And he is drilled at the 48 yard line. Picks up a yard. That's a gain of one on the play. That brings up second and nine. Second down and nine to go. Ball on the 49. Completes it, and he's hit hard immediately. Nothing going on that play. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws it. We played three, and this is not what the experts predicted. 24-3, Cougars. Back in this very pivotal fourth quarter. You think you're gonna get this? You think you're gonna get this? Hey, check Mike 45. Check Mike 45. Scrambling around. Quarterback's gonna run it, and he's got room to work. He's at the 30, and he's taken down around the 20 yard line. This play is number eight on the drive. Now he tries to buy some time. He's taken down at the 18. Second down and eight. Ball on the 18 yard line. Four down, four down. Hey, check Mike 45. Let's go. 
and he's level at the 16-yard line. Gain of two yards. That makes it 37. Tenth play of the drive. Hey, watch number 33. Watch number 33. Let's get it together, defense. Let's get it together. Here we go. Why did he aim? And they get nice yardage on that run. That's good for a game of four yards. This should be an easy field goal. It's up, and it's through the uprights. Brigham Young is ready to kick it away. He just drills this one. This one's going to be down in the end zone for a touchback. The defense was able to keep him out of the end zone on their last possession, but the offense did pick up three. Slings it out and it gets tipped. From their own 25 yard line, it's second down. They'll bring him down around the 33 yard line. Down right around the 40. Game of seven on the play. First down. Mike 41. You got to wedge that, huh? Kill, kill, kill. Slam, slam, slam. Pulls down the catch and he's got room here. He's tackled around the 49 yard line. Game of nine on the play. Let's go. That brings up second and one. Just under three to go in regulation. Makes the grab past the marker. Call it a gain of six yards. That makes it first and ten. Hey, kill. Kill. Out of bounds around the 42-yard line. That makes it second and six. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. I'm coming after you. Hey, go, kill, go, kill, kill, kill! Green, Gets to about the 41 yard line. And they'll look to convert here on another third down. 41's coming, 41's the mic. I got it, I got it. Quick throw, and he's tackled at the 31 yard line. He gets rid of this one. Here's play number 10 on the drive. Fires quick, he catches another. That's a great tackle at the 22. At the 22 yard line. That'll make it third down. He's hit and taken down. That's good for a gain of seven yards. First is down. Finds a man. Touchdown. That's a positive for the passing game. It was absolutely the right call in that situation. So the offense will stay on the field and attempt the two-point conversion. A quarterback in the gun with five Black receivers. Five. Hey, kill, kill, kill! Black five. He's in for the conversion. He 
He's tackled at the 44. Both teams are well aware that a score on this drive is going to create an almost insurmountable lead. This defense has really got to step it up and make a stop. Just under two minutes in the game. Takes it up the middle for a nice run. Oklahoma State's going to use their first time out of the half here. They need about three yards to get the first here on second down. Good outside run there. And that's a first down. First down, and now they have an opportunity to run some more time off the clock. Makes it to the 24. Great job by the running back, and that's a gain of nine. The Cowboys, they're going to have to call their third and final timeout. And he makes it out to about the 21-yard line. From the 21-yard line, it's first down. Gets out to about the 21. And this should be a kneel down as they just try to kill the clock. He takes a knee, looking to take some time off that clock. Oklahoma State staff and really his entire team, I'm sure, is going to rally around this kid. Yeah, it's a tough loss for this team. I mean, they put so much into this game. But one thing about them is they're, they're a team. And even though their star player had a tough game, I think they'll pick him back up and get him ready to go by next week. That's going to do it for this presentation of NCAA Football 14. For Kirk Herbstreit, this is Brad Nessler saying goodbye.